Hello, and welcome back to Elden Ring. Was the cliffhanger alright? Did you survive a single day without this? So alright, let's try to beat this guy. Invade Vagram the Raging Wolf and Aaron Sorcerer Wilhelm's word. That was a lot of, uh, of words and people. I'm gonna have a hard time against them because there's two of them. Oh, I have a friend too. Oh, he's easy. Don't that. Tag team! Yay! Okay, that's that's nice. That's good. So technically we could go back to the full Oh, but first, Raging Wolf Helm, Raging Wolf Armor, Raging Wolf Gauntlets, and Raging Wolf Grieve, the whole Raging Wolf set. But yeah, like I was saying, we could technically go back to Volcano Manor and uh, just Say hello to our pal and uh, confirm our quest. Helm worn by Vagram, by Vagram the Raging Wolf. One of the first tarnished to visit the Round Table Hold. Vagram's nickname comes from the White Wolf Mane that decorate this helm. Ah, oh, pretty straightforward. Uh, this is the thing. Armor worn by Vagram for tarnish. According to old legend, Wolf are the shadow of Empyrean, and this this is what Vagram aspired to be. He aspired to shadow Empyrean. Um, according to old legend, yeah, it's the same. Also, and so is this one. All right. Well, I'm starting off with a bang, a tag team fight, and everything. That's kind of cool. All right, what do you have? Alberich pointed hats, Alberich robe, Alberich brace, and Alberich trouser. Well, I'm starting off with a lot of reading, that's for sure. Uh, where is the thing? Right here. Mad Tong Alberich's pointed hat, a sign of heretical practitioner. Set with red glintstone, said to be formed by the Blood of Sacrifice, strengthened Torn Sorcery. Albrecht was aloof yet dis disturbed, heretical sorcerer said to have been driven mad by jeering tongue during his service to the Round Table Hold long ago. What is a jeering tongue? You know what? I don't. I don't think I want to know. Uh, that's not the one. It's right here. I was actually select on it. I'm crazy. Mad Tongue Albridge robe set with red glintstones to be formed with the blood sacrifice. Albridge was a Luffy, a disturbed heretical sorcerer, driven by by Jiring Tongue. Same description. I'm gonna guess everything else has the same description. It sure does. Just to be extra safe. Yep. Yep. Same description for everything. It's a bit dark in here as well. But yes, in case you... I mean, you probably remember when he jumped into that room, we had a fight against somebody. And uh, this somebody is... Uh, is who this... Uh, Alber... Something that we just got the gear of. Which is kind of nice. Grace head. Oh, there is a Grace head. Nice! Super nice. And this? 
the flightless bird painting. All right. Nice. Now, what should I do? I'm going to travel a little bit. I kind of want to get a few things on the way if I can. Plus, I don't really want to go back up and faff about, so I'm just going to go around here. It feels weirdly empty in here for some reason. I don't like that. Hello. Haven't talked to you in a while. Uh, you. What is it? I don't know. A hug? Well, nothing new to say. Okay. The dung eater is definitely gonna have something to say to us, but first... Of a bell bearing, because I have a ton of them. So, each is bell bearing. Then, gravity stone peddler. Then, medicine peddler. Then, bone peddler. Then, glowworth pecker. Then, of course, somber miner's bell. And, smithing's minor bell. Now, if we try to purchase things, as you can see, we have unlocked quite a few things. Grave go Glowworth and Ghost Glowworth, which is very, very nice, as well as Smithing Stone and Somber Smithing Stone, all the way to 4. Extra, extra cool. And we also got a lot of bone that we can buy, a lot of boulders, I don't know if those were... No, those were not accessible before, as well as a few stone things and the like. Lots and lots of good stuff. All right, Tur D top Seluvis, everything's. Wait a minute, Seluvis? Oh, I could buy his thing. Right, this is the character I mess up his side quest with. My bad. All right, hello, friend. Have you ever felt the curse with your whole being, the pox upon life itself? Feared and despised by all. The reviled blessing. <laughs> Apparently not. You are but a lamb. A strange as a defilement. Ignorant of your own ignorance. You no longer interest me. I've been long without peace. Don't spoil my quietude. Come on, man. No. Wait. Yes. You have felt the curse. I can smell it on you. The box, yet tender. Apparently my seed bed is ripe and waiting. It was a brief respite, I must say. Go and unshackle my corporeal flesh, trapped in the sewer jail below the capital. All right. I can kill you and defile your corpse. Then the pox will truly be your own. That was a creepy thing to say. Go and unshackle my corporeal flesh, trapped in the sewer jail below the capital. I can kill you and defile your corpse. Then the pox will truly be your own. Yeah, okay, let's go somewhere else. So, with the dung eater, there's a few things you can do. Once you have found his corporeal flesh that is shackled, by the way, which is very, very nice for us, you can, if you still have Seluvis' potion, give it to him. And he will move to Seluvis' rise and he will be a puppet to be purchased, or something along those lines, anyway. Greetings. Are you here for spirit tuning? Yes, probably. I can hear it from across the wing, passed around the house. Yeah, 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 yeah. You should keep your distance. I know you're strong. Don't worry about it. Everything's cool. I don't have grave glory or whatever it was. Well, I took you, Mama, to lay out your arms. Uh, everything's cool. I can beef up this bad boy. 
You know what? Yeah, why not? And again. And now we need somber ancient dragon smithing stone, which is not gonna happen for a while. I could technically faff about with other weapon, but I'll do this on my own time. I'll figure it out if I want to switch out my style, which I don't really want to, because this one's very cool. I like it. So nothing here. All the way at the end of the hole. I don't think there's anything, but just to be safe, let's check it out anyway. Yep, a heck of a lot of nothing. Okay. If I go down, there is still a... Uh, what's her name? Nefeli Lu that's just sitting there and waiting for something. In this ash, it reminds me yep. Yep. Her side quest isn't gonna progress yet. We need to do something special before it happened. And I don't remember what this special something is, so you know, kudos to me for being amazing. And now... You. I honestly don't know what's up. You know what? I guess nothing. Oh, hello. Briar Helm. Wait, that's the that's the bell bearing hunter set. Battered iron helm from a foreign land worn by Elmer of the Briar. The winding rust iron briar are mark of the guilty and typically indicate a sentence of death. They also cause this armor to deal damage when performing dodge roll. Oh that's that's a classic. Elmer murdered numerous instructor and merchant and was known as the bell bearing hunter. I'll take that. Uh, when there's some... Yes, yeah, same description. I'm still gonna buy those though. I could technically buy these, those seem excessive though. Now go flat to work. Yep. High five? Can I high five you? Not quite. Not quite. Sadly enough, I cannot high five it. Well, I, I dig my look at the moment, but what if I were to change? It's lighter ar armor, which is kind of cool. But yeah, I don't want to do damage with my roly poly. Everything's fine. So, I'm going to call it quits right now, I think. Yeah, I'm going to call it quits right now. Seems fair enough. So, like always, I bid you... A glorious day, and I'll see you on the next episode of Elden Ring. Bye-bye. I forgot to do this. Bye.